welkom, 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 welkom back to the channel. I am still Dimitri the Watch Doctor and I am still alive. And first and foremost I would like to apologize for not uploading any new videos for two years. But as of today this has changed. We're back like never before. In the past three years I became a father of two children, two beautiful children. And this was an intense but also oh beautiful time. Now that everything is a bit easier, especially more sleep at night, I can continue with my YouTube channel and I hope you will like it. So, in this video you will see how we will change the plexiglass of this vintage Tissot watch because it's very damaged and also broken and uh, the look of the watch will be very different like it is now. Uh, to remove the plexiglass you can use a special tool like this Bergeon tool but actually you don't need it. You can also um, remove the plexiglass by hand and I will show you and that I will show you in a minute. We will open the watch case uh, so we can remove the plexiglass at the inner side. So we, re we, we remove the watch case back. It's a little tight. Voila. And now you can see the tissue caliber and you can see that the second hand is touching the minute hand that's not normal of course so we need to adjust that but that's not for now and now the magic will happen just push at the plexiglass and as you can see it's very easy we have removed the plexiglass from the watch case it's a plexiglass with an uh, it's an armored plexiglass with an chrome ring in inside The big difference between uh, plexiglass with metal tension ring or without is that the uh, plexiglasses with a metal tension ring have greater water resistance. And there is also a difference on how to install them. start with a plexiglass without metal tension ring. For that I use my uh, Robur adapters like you can see
when you want to install a plexiglass without metal, metal tensioning uh, you, the plexiglass itself needs to be 0.3 millimeters larger than the diameter of the watch case because it needs a little bit of tension to hold the plexiglass in place because we put the plexiglass under tension with our rubber press you can now see that the glass is actually too small for the watch case as soon as we release the tension you will see that the watch glass will become fixed into the watch case and if you want to remove the glass again you can do so by simply applying some pressure to the inside of the watch glass And there you go, this was a plexiglass without tension ring, now let's place a plexiglass with tension ring. And for that we need our rubber set again, and for now we use the flat adapter for the bottom, because we need to support the watch case. It's a little bit different um, than by a plexiglass without tension ring. Like you see, now we support the watch case with the flat adapter, and we just put the uh, the plexiglass with tension ring on the top of the watch case. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. It's free and if you want to hit the bell icon, you will be notified whenever I publish new content. I see you in my next video. Thank you.